for many reasons. Obviously, the you know Geneva has a uh, is a premium location from a geographic standpoint, a logistic standpoint, uh, an infrastructure standpoint. You know, for organizing international multi-companies uh, events. Um, everybody thinks about obviously the heritage around the United Nations, uh, the neutrality of, uh, of Switzerland and so on, which is a great place to gather. But it's really beyond that because obviously uh, Geneva on top of having these uh, skill sets of organizing such events uh, is a sort of a home place to two leading companies in the fragrance industries. Uh, Givaudan, which uh, basically I manage uh, uh, because I'm the CEO of Givaudan. Uh, but DSM Firminich, which is also a Geneva-based uh, home-rooted uh, created company. Uh, so the two of us you know, are um, you know, big players of the fragrance industries. Obviously, we have many other players joining, uh, joining and gathering at the WPC, which can be fragrance houses such as uh, Givaudan, but also suppliers and as well as clients, because Geneva is also a home place for many clients of us. So it really creates an ecosystem, uh, which is quite, which, which makes a lot of sense to have uh, the World Perfumery Council organized in. So this is really, a, I would say, a very natural thing to have it in Geneva. You, you have at the World Perfumery Council, you, you can see it today, is that you have many, many companies coming from abroad. You know, I can see many people coming from Brazil, coming from India, uh, coming from Japan. Um, so it's actually Geneva is a destination uh, by its essence, quite attractive to foreigners. Going to Switzerland is always, you know, something uh, uh, which represents a lot to, to, to foreign people. So on top of it, uh, you know, it's, Geneva is very attractive for foreigners coming with their companies to be represented here at the WPC.